Good morning, friends. It's Sammy, woo! I always love when I see myself for the first time on here. It's Sammy back with another episode of The Daily Dash. That's right, it's everything you need to know from around the world and in my life, straight from my card dashboard to yours. Today is Thursday, Thursday, June 23rd, 2016. It's late, I'm gonna have to make it fast because it is blazing hot in the dash. I actually was gonna bring you the dash from the kitchen today, except that I've been doing all morning, um, but my husband started putting stuff away, so I brought it to you. So hang on for that. I will tell you what is going on this morning in my kitchen. Oh, FedEx may be stopping by. Should we do like a live FedEx grab? Come with me. I've never done this before either, but I feel like I should meet the FedEx guy. Hey, I can grab that from you. Save you a trip to the door. Thank you. Stay cool. Got a FedEx box. This is better light out here. I don't know what that is. We'll look at that later. Okay. Sorry. I didn't. also didn't want to be here like as he walked by talking to the camera. That would have been rude. Okay. So back to the news that you need to know so you are in the know around the water cooler and in car line today. Um, the House had a major debate on gun control. I'm going to take it as those hearts as that you liked me going rogue there. Um, or that you like the cockatoo on my head. I'm not sure what's going on with that there. I did shower last night though. Uh, okay, so house, gun control, crazy debate. Uh, there's a father and his children that are lost at the Gulf of Mex on the Gulf of Mexico. Iceland won their first major, thank you Jennifer, won their first major um, competition in a soccer tournament. Go Iceland. Um, Oh, and Cleveland celebrated at home. They did their big, like, celebration yesterday at home. So lots more news, but that's just a few tidbits so that you are in the know. Okay, so, you know, I've been trying to go healthy, eat healthy, the gluten-free thing. We'll talk about that later. But, um, you know, I love getting cookbooks from the library. So last night I was looking over the latest one I got from the Legacy Girls. Yes, Emerald's Daughters. I guess they're gluten-free. And so I made, um, here I brought props. Too bad you can't taste these, right? So zucchini carrot muffins. Now here's what I will say. Do you like, you're going to laugh at the blueberry muffin liners in a second. These are, it's like I tell my kids, even though there's zucchini and carrot, there's also sour cream in these. There's some, a little bit of sugar. So these aren't totally like healthy, like the blueberry muffins, but they are gluten-free and they were delish. I always try to make the recipe pretty close to the recipe the first time I do something. And so these were delish, I have to say, and I don't even like sour cream, but you don't taste them. Okay, then here's our Mickey Mouse liners. You like that? Because we just use what we got. These are blueberry muffins from the Daniel plan. Now I haven't eaten these yet because I was so full from those. And then we made oatmeal banana pancakes with caramelized apples on top. Good stuff. And those were really healthy. I mean, there was, again, gluten-free. Um, a little bit of sugar to caramelize the apples, but otherwise, good stuff. Okay, so those were really good. And then these are Daniel Plan blueberry muffins um, that are, I'm gonna take a little bite, hang on. They're good. They're really good. These have like six ingredients in them, so I was honestly not optimistic. But if you're eating something that's totally healthy, I'm okay with it, especially when it's a baked good. Um, these are good. Okay. These are more for my daughter. Um, our natural health person said to do some kind of like fibery blueberry muffin. So I added some psyllium husks to this. Good. Um, so I'm going to go make some thumbprint cookies because our kids have a swimathon tomorrow to raise money for the Nashville Dolphins. Shouldn't eat on camera. Um, and when they're doing a bake sale, so I'm going to do that. And finally, we get to go see BFG tonight. I won't be able to talk about it until next week. Um, was not excited about this from the previews, but usually those are the movies I end up liking the best, ironically. So, hey, Brenna. So, we are going to see that. And this is, from what I hear, the first time Steven Spielberg has uh, partnered with Disney for an animated film. So, I can't believe that's true, but there we go. Okay, I'm going to run. See, I'm just gonna make it fast. I'm sweating already. I hope you guys have a great day wherever you are. Make sure you make it great and don't wait to tell someone you love how you feel about them. Bye friends.